Bloodlines, a vampire murder mystery game, is easy to assemble. There are ten player booklets with four pages each. Once printed, simply fold the page in half, and then half again, making sure the skull graphic is on the front. The booklets are put together in round order. Here you can see the Countess, round one, round two, round three, and round four. Stack the four pages in order and then using a stapler, staple along the edge of the booklet. And here you can see the first booklet completed in just a matter of minutes. And now let's move on to the clues. There are 12 clues to print. Each is clearly marked as to which player's booklet it is to be inserted into along with which round. Here we have Charles Hunter's clue, round 4. So fold up the clue and place it into the Charles Hunter booklet, round four. Along with the round marked on the top right side of the page, it also states, insert clue here at the bottom. Here we have Jonathan Harker's clue, round one. So again, fold up that clue and insert it into the Jonathan Harker booklet, round one. Once you have finished assembling the booklets, you will find that you have made five booklets for the male players and five booklets for the female players. Next, we'll print out the two-page solution that you can fold up and put into an envelope for use at the end of the game. There's also the last will and testament of Count Aphius Blackwell. I've included two versions that you can choose from, one that's a bit easier to read and a second graphic version. The Vampire Murder Mystery Game also comes with customizable menus, four different Blackwell Estate wine labels for both red and white wine, table seating name tags, and of course a selection of beautiful invitations that you can choose from with character backgrounds, costume suggestions, and even a short history of the Blackwell family. So now you have everything that you need to create a fantastic evening for your friends. <laughs>